As late May arrives, the wheat of the grains begin to plump up, signaling the onset of the grain bud season, also known as Xiao Ma. Grain bud season is the eighth solar term of the year and the second solar term in summer. An ancient Chinese book precisely described the arrival of Xiao Ma as the time when the seeds of the grains reach their plump stage but have not yet ripened. With the arrival of Xiaoman, precipitation increases further. There is a popular saying in southern China that goes Xiaoman, Xiaoman, Jianghe, Jianmen, which means when the solar term grain bud arrives, the rivers gradually begin to rise. While in northern China, the grains of summer crops such as wheat tend to reach their full maturity during this time, which is encapsulated in the proverb Xiaoman, Xiaoman, Mai Li, Jianmen. In ancient times, people would eat bitter herbs, ride water wells, and worship the silkworm god. They would also sprinkle bowls of water in the field to prepare for farming and expect a good harvest. Strolling through the fields, one is captivated by the gentle sway of the wheat in the breeze, while the intensing aroma of ripening wheat fills the air. The ancient Chinese people call the fourth month of the lunar calendar Mai Tian, which means wheat days. Only after Xiao Man can you smell the wheat as it's ripening in the fields. The wheat is maturing day by day. The days of anticipation are imbued with hope and a sense of eager expectation. That's right. Actually, Xiao Man is not only closely related to farming, but also rich in connotations drawn from Chinese philosophy. If you read between lines of Xiao Man, you will know that in Chinese, Xiao means little and Man means full. The combination of these two characters indicates things are not full to their extreme. I know that Chinese philosophy cherishes the virtue of moderation, while Chinese paintings emphasize the significance of empty spaces. In the eyes of common people, finding containment is synonymous with happiness. I think such a perspective reflects the life attitude embraced by Chinese people. And I think this can be perfectly summed up in the Chinese verse. Ren shang zui hao shi xiao men, hua wei shuan kai yue wei yuan. The best state in life is finding containment with little. Just like a flower not in full bloom, and a moon not fully round. There's another Chinese agent that goes, man zhao sun, qian shou yi. It means pride leads to loss, while modesty brings benefit. The name of Xiao Ma embodies the profound philosophy embedded within the characters of the Chinese people and their approach to life. In the central basin of North China's Shanxi province, farmers would always be busy at this time of the year. Mechanized harvesting methods have become more prevalent now. The grain pot season is also the time to pick up different kinds of fruits, such as cherry. The grain pot season is also the time to pick up different kinds of fruits, such as cherry. 